Hi Dimitri, it's Brent. So here is the, the test setup that I got going here. Here's my uh, test radio on 40 meters. So you can see we're set to 40 meters. Here we'll go to adjust the power. Our power set says 8 watts. Let's see. About six watts on the meter, and if you look on here, it does transmit. Light comes on, I okay, hear a relay clicking, but no power out. Um, the only thing is I noticed was that, but I don't know if that's normal, but if you look at one of the tabs on the transistor, it looks like it wasn't flat soldered all the way down, so I'm not sure if that's one of the issues, but I did not see anything that was burnt other than that transistor. I don't know if that was how it was. It looks like something was smeared on it or something. I, I don't know. Um, but here we'll just do a quick look through the whole amplifier. I didn't see any of the coils from the low-pass filters melted or anything like that. Um, there's the tandem match. I can see that but yeah I I'm at a loss here um, but yeah we'll uh, try a different band here we're hooked up to a dummy load so here we'll go to we'll go to 20 meters here oop we don't want 100 watts go back down to was eight watts packet so we have good amount of power Let's make sure that the power is still set to low power still set to 8 I'll just double check here yeah this will be our one to one And uh, I guess we could go to another band. Just to verify, we'll go up to the 160. Power still set to there. So yeah, I don't know. Hopefully you have a, an idea. I'd really hate to have to send this back, but um, yeah, it's something's definitely wrong here.